Hello friends, in the last video we have seen how to configure Solid and the installation process. In this video we will see how to index data in Solid and uh, as well as updating the data and deleting the data and so on. So first we will start with indexing the data. For it, one thing I want to tell you that uh, this is the folder you have uh, copy and uh, in the example folder there is a solar folder and sorry in the example docs folder you can see there are various xml files for example monitor.xml monitor2.xml and so on these are the xml files in which the data is given in the form like this uh, in, in this field name id there is usd and name is one dollar and so on these are different docs from here from this doc to this doc this is a single doc and indexing is basically done in the form of docs so there are different different docs one more thing here uh, the field id is uh, is uh, treated as a unique key for each doc and uh, yes it is uh, but obvious that uh, for every doc you have to make one thing unique no matter it is id or name you can do it for yourself and uh, if you want to change uh, the uniqueness of id and you want to make something else unique you have to go in the schema.xml and replace the field for example I will show you I will more discuss about it but uh, in the meanwhile I will show you how to change it for example uh, let me open it first in, uh, in this folder yeah. In the schema.xml you can change the unique key for example here is the unique key special id and uh, you make it id you can, you can make it name or whatever but you have to remember just one thing that your field is defined in this uh, schema.xml file and, okay. and if you are making changes Remember one thing: if you are making changes in schema.xml or uh, solar config.xml, you have to restart your solar. Okay, and for restarting your solar, you have to just uh, open the command prompt where you have uh, made it right. Just press uh, Control plus C, and uh, you can see shut down or complete. And the solar is shut down. Now you will again type the following command I have shown you before and you will again press enter. The server will paste it. Okay. So now I will uh, I will show you how to index data in Okay. So uh, for indexing the data, open a new command prompt and uh, this to the solar folder you have created. Okay. In the example folder, go to the uh, example docs. And here, for uh, indexing the data, there is a file post.jar. Let me show you first. In the example folder, in the example docs folder. You can see here is a post.jar file. It is responsible for posting the data in Solar. Okay. So now we see the way uh, in which we first uh, index the data in Solar. So you have to first because uh, uh, you are running the jar file, so you you have to apply the same way I have told you before. Jar file jar post dot jar space and the name of the file you want to index okay for example you want to index uh, monitor dot 
XML file. This one. So type monitor dot XML. Okay. And press enter. Just uh, for example, you know that uh, you know you know the uh, ID already. You want to search it. Okay. Just open. Okay. Just uh, copy the ID field and uh, paste it here and just click on the search button now you can see the data uh, the index and uh, here uh, number of found rows is 1 ok so uh, id was unique and when we have searched it all the following pages respective to this id are shown here ok we have index uh, monitor.xml here you can see the id and all the fields name menu cat category okay. here you are seeing that uh, cat is printed twice written twice this cat is uh, multi value field you can specify a field is multi valued or not if it is multi valued you can give multiple values to it okay so here you can see that uh, okay, the data is uh, showing after indexing. So here is your first indexing is done. Okay, now I will uh, show you uh, that uh, how to update your data. Okay. For updating the data, just uh, make changes uh, to your uh, to your indexing file for example here I, I have indexed uh, this document so I will make changes in it for example uh, the name actual I have changed to Dell and uh, menu I have changed to Samsung ok and in stock I have made it false I have uh, changed the price and I have changed uh, the weight and, and, and you can make more changes ok in category I have uh, made it uh, keyboard and, just say. and one more thing I want to tell you when you have indexed or updated or deleted your data you need not uh, restart your solar ok just uh, copy the command and uh, re it now again committing solar index changes so this uh, index, uh, indexing is done and from here from the server you can see that uh, commit equals to true for this uh, activity uh, a commit command is run and so indexing is done in this one. ok so uh, I will make I will uh, make a duplicate tab of it here you can see uh, the id is this one and through USB cable menu is del name is SCL and uh, all the things here but in this uh, in this uh, uh, in this tab you can see after updating the data the values are changed the weight is changed but the weight was before uh, 401 and now the weight is 303 the data is updated one more thing I want to tell you that uh, when you update your data and respect uh, for uh, respective to the ID because here ID is unique, so it will check in the index data if ID is present, it will replace the whole data. And uh, for example, you are uh, updating an ID. Okay, if the ID is uh, already there in the index data, it will replace the whole data. If ID is not present, it will make a new entry in the in the, in, in, uh, the indexing data. Okay, so here the update is done. Now I will show you how to delete the data. In this uh, monitor.xml file, 
there are different different ids okay now i will uh, show you how to delete this id okay let's say this id okay Yeah, for for deleting uh, the ID, here is the command. This one, Java, the data is equals to ARDS, the command equal to fire, plus jar, minus jar, post dot jar. Okay, post dot jar is responsible for indexing, updating, and deleting the data. And uh, here is uh, in quotes uh, the command delete ID value and Delete. So copy and paste uh, in the new command prompt you have open. Paste it here and just uh, type the value of the ID you want to. Delete. Also copy this from here and uh, paste. Yeah. When you press enter, the data corresponding to this ID will be deleted. Okay. So the deletion is done. And the ID you have said, you can see there is. Uh, Number of found equal to zero. So it is very clear. But uh, before it, I wanna make you uh, one more thing. I wanna make you inform one more thing that uh, uh, when you have indexed the data, you need that to restart the server. When you have uh, you have to update the data, you need that to start the restart the server. But when you are deleting the data from the in, from the index data, you have to restart the solar. Okay, Let's, uh, remember this thing very carefully. So uh, till now we have uh, discussed uh, uh, what is solar, the installation of solar, how to configure it, and a basic indexing. And uh, updating the routine in solar. Okay. Uh, thank you.